What is going on, guys? Your boy, Kiru. Today, I'm bringing a different type of episode. No, I won't be playing Apex, but we're going to be reacting to some videos. If you guys enjoyed this type of content, make sure to drop a like, join the live streams, and ask for the Discord. That way, y'all could join it, too. We have a little bit of an issue here. All right, chat. All right, all right, all right, all right. The camera's right here. My monitor's right here. So, if I look over here, that means I'm watching my monitor. Then, if over here, I'm going to be talking to y'all. All right? You got it? 10-4? Let's get it. All right, shout out my boy James Flux. I think that's his name. James Flux. For this video, uh, I'm going to be tagging everybody's TikToks on the link below on the description. So, y'all want to watch the videos yourselves. The, the links will be on the description. Let's go. Uh, that's an awkward way to pause the video. But, finally, Mirage and Pathfinder. Golly, man. Okay. Okay. I guess my space button don't work. Pathfinder is finally gonna have a passive. Lifeline's ultimate will be dropping ten times faster now. Did I make up the ten times bit? Yes, but it will drop faster. All right, all right. From the assault pack, and you'll be able to open the secret compartment on the new red supply bin. This will give you ammo and attachment. Blue supply. Okay, we getting somewhere. Hey, finally they did something. No wonder this new season of Apex. I kept saying that from the get-go, this new season of Apex was so garbage and butt cheeks and peaches and everything. Like, it was so bad. Like, honestly, it's so bad. I kept telling everyone on chat for my 20,000 viewers. Okay, probably get like 10. But this, this season is so bad. It really is bad, man. It's horrible. They didn't do anything. All they did was take out attachments for my 2020 that I keep getting every fucking... No, I don't want to even talk about it. Finally, that makes sense. Okay, thank you. I agree with you, bro. Man, I like this guy. I'm a, I actually should follow him. I think I did follow him. I like this guy. I really do like this guy. And for this one, it says, these are the two worst legends in Apex right now. Before we watch the video, comment below what's the two worst legends for you. It could be different, you know. Maybe you like... I guess it's Crypto and Revenant, but you probably like these two legends, but personally, I despise these legends. I wasn't liking Catalyst at all either, but now I like her. I didn't like Mad Maggie, but she low-key good. But yeah, I think these two are my worst. Nah, I think I have worse ones. Worst legends in Apex Legends right now. But Gabby, there's no such thing as a bad legend, only a bad player. Wrong time. There is such thing as a bad legend. You're misconstruing a That is true. That is true, chat. My god, you're so bad. That legend's good. No, it's not. No, it's not. Stop. It's like Mirage. I use Mirage. But he's useless at times, bro. The only good thing about him is his ult. And that's times where you're playing against brain dead people. Other than that, let's keep going. There's a difference. Anyway, one. Crypto. You know how I feel about crypto and it's for a reason. Crypto has fallen so far off the regime that I laugh whenever there is one in my match. <laughs> absolute worst thing a crypto can do to me or anyone else is annoy the fuck out of them by flying around in their drone accomplishing absolutely nothing not to mention they're not only annoying the enemy but the poor poor teammates who get this cunt on their team well done dickhead did you know that if you got out of your drone and just helped your team once in a while you'd win more games uh, i kind of agree and i don't agree because i have played with good ass cryptos he is good like He's not the best, but he is good if you know how to use the drone. But also, if... Okay, so there's a thing. So it's either you're good with crypto or you're charged with crypto. There's no in between, all right? And that's the issue, you know what I mean? So, like, if you can't... You haven't used crypto, then you're going to be really bad. But if you're really good with it, then you could do so many good plays. Like, I see people throw their drone and boom, oh, and that's a safe, bro. You push it. Ta -ta -ta -ta. Game. Game. to just play revenant so that they can say that they play revenant this motherfucking cockroach looking weird bitch is so bad like <laughs> yo <laughs> bro this guy hates this guy really hates revenant with a passion i fuck with it <laughs> yo he is bad though his silence is okay and can be decent at times but that's it his fucking ultimate is a light out that literally just screams out to anyone with a 1k to your hire to come camp the totem and wipe them as soon as they're sent yeah i do that i'm that guy with the 1kd that's me Guru. 
Some some weeb on TikTok who's really good at Revenant, you want me to go watch their videos. Well, I'm not going to. Because guess what? If they're that good with Revenant, they would be... Alright, one thing. Okay, now Revenant's pretty bad. But back then, when you had Revenant and Octane, yeah, I remember the meta. That's when I first came to Apex again. I think I believe it was Season 8, Season 9, or Season 7, whatever. Revenant with Octane... God, no. Revenant with Octane were the... That was not it, chat. I'm telling you, that was not it. Revenant with Octane, all you had to do was pop your ult. It wouldn't make noise like it does now. You pop your ult, you get an Octane, you throw your jump in. Bro, nah. I mean, he got a nerve, so that's why. But Revenant is pretty bad. I still think, like, Crypto's worse. But... Alright, chat. So this is the video or the TikTok we are waiting for. What? We been waiting for. My bad for my English, you know. That's a little bit like Spanglish, a little bit of, I don't know, English. Yeah, 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 I know. Oh, my God. <laughs> he doesn't know English. I don't care, all right? I got besties. But we are going to watch my boy Seer right now. Heirloom. And I guess by the title, this guy wrote the title of 20 paragraphs. All the showstoppers. Okay, so let's get to it. Let's get to it. Oh, wait. No audio. <laughs> I'm such a kid. What is it? Content creator. Sears heirloom known as the Showstoppers will be coming out next week during the Spellbound Collection event. You'll need to come up. 10. Alright, look, look, look. Before we keep going, I actually love this. I actually love this heirloom. I'm not gonna lie to you. And there's only w there's one reason why, and this is why. No! For those that don't watch anime, but I'm pretty sure y'all do. Demon Slayer. This is the reason why I love Sears Heirloom. I right, chat. The demon had these too. They just look different type. No, they're the same actually. I used to call them sides, but they're not sides. I don't know what they're called, chat. But bro, this guy was so like I actually look how badass he looks, bro. That's how I'm feeling when I'm using Sears. No cap. All right. If you feel the same, bro, leave a like right now, bro. For real, for real. I'm, I actually think I'm buying this. I'm buying these. Let me know your thoughts on Sears heirloom and this event. I love this heirloom. Hopefully, I'm just praying that they has good skins. This raid skin that y'all, some of y'all be out here running around with the new prestige raid skin, bro. Y'all got ripped off. I'm sorry to tell y'all that. Y'all literally bought like twenty, no, like ten. Um, y'all bought ten same cosmetics that were there, just different color. Bro, y'all got ripped off. I'm sorry. If I were y'all, would get my refund like I did on Fortnite. But that'll be it, guys. It was your boy, Guru. If you like the content, make sure to check out the live streams. I'll be on every afternoon. Depends on the timing, how lazy I am that day. But I do live stream every single day. I love you guys. Thank you for being in the Guru gang. And I'll see you guys next time. Guru!